Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new, I am Steph Sherry and I am so happy you're here. In today's video, I am bringing all the cleaning motivation. I have a small grocery haul and also a really easy and affordable crock pot meal. Also stick around to the end. Two of my teenagers are going to try to recreate what I do in my videos. They think they're pretty funny. I'll let you be the judge, um, but let's get started. On this day, it was the day after we had just gotten back from a weekend getaway with some friends. It was so much fun and really needed, but I was really behind on laundry and all. obviously coming back from a trip, you just have to kind of reset a little bit. So I am going to unpack all of our bags and get it all done. And I hope you can join me and um, tackle a room in your house that also needs to be cleaned. I get so caught up in the middle Thinking of drowning in those blue eyes I'm losing sight cause I am falling I'm so deep down, deep down And it's not a lie Does anyone else take about a million vitamins every day? I take mine at night. Uh, it's the only time I can remember to take any kind of medicine um, but mine are all in gummy form because I'm <laughs> basically a child and I just feel like sometimes I'm taking too many um, but there there's just so many like even just the women's one a day I don't feel like gives you enough of each type of vitamin so I supplement with others and then by the time I'm done I feel like I've eaten like an entire package of candy Leave me a comment down below and let me know what kind of vitamins you use. What do you love? What do you hate? Um, but I don't know that I can get rid of the gummy form. I really don't like swallowing pills. Here I am unpacking our bathroom bag. I know this is a really big bag, but my husband and I share it when we go on really small trips. And I definitely overpack. I pack literally almost everything I can think of uh, for emergencies, freak accidents. <laughs> Anything that you can think of, I throw it in the bag, even for just like a day and a half trip. It's insane, but you never know. I can hide. On this little TV stand, I am cleaning up these pink sprays. This stuff is called the Pink Stuff. I just ordered it. It came in a set with a bathroom spray, a multi-service spray, and then also a little jar of like putty. And I'm really excited to give this a try in my oven. I don't know who else gets excited about cleaning their oven other than me. I'm just kind of weird like that. Um, and then today's video, I am using Method and Clementine.
watch the sun go down over the same old town like so many times before we look at the same old stars battle the same old wars like so many times before and i know that we're not perfect Next, I'm moving into my living room. This room was actually really clean on this day. It just needed to be straightened up a little bit, which was a miracle because we weren't home all weekend. And so I thought for sure this room would be kind of junked out with some teenagers. I had the house to themselves. So I just dusted the furniture a little bit, um, but not a whole lot needed to be done in this room. But I'll be okay if you stay. Next, I'm moving into my kitchen. I absolutely dread cleaning this kitchen. I know people hate cleaning bathrooms and toilets, but this is my space. I do not like this one. It never feels clean to me. And in this video, you'll see I'm cleaning it now. And then at the end, my teenagers are gonna try to clean it, I think like the very next day. Um, so, I mean, it just one single meal in this family and the whole room feels like we're starting over. Um, also, if you notice in the background, there are piles and piles of laundry. Um, that is one of very many that I'm trying to catch up on. So we're just going to try to get it all done today.
Someone else. I'm gonna skip my breaks. I'm gonna make mistakes. I'm gonna skip my breaks. I'm gonna make mistakes. I'm gonna be myself. I'm gonna be someone else. I'm gonna be myself. I'm gonna be someone else. I'm gonna skip my breaks. I'm gonna make mistakes. I'm gonna skip my breaks. I'm gonna make mistakes. Try not to hold me down. Feel alive. Nothing can break me. You got me dancing in a storm, burning everything we know. Dressing up as firefighters. You got me dancing in your storm. Or I'm looking like a breeze, but really you're a forest fire. You got me feeling uncomplicated. Whatever happens is meant for us. Okay, just got back from the grocery store. So I have a small haul just for, I guess, like three days. So this is our fruit. I'm gonna wash my grapes, my raspberries, and blackberries. And then we have five, I think this is five honey crisps. These are my favorite apples. 
and then bananas and these will go insanely quick um, so my daughter will take these and her lunches and then my husband and I will split these during the week and then these are just for everyone to grab um, but my son my youngest son and my husband eat these like like they're just nothing then for lunches during the week we have I mean I guess it looks like a lot of stuff but we are a family of six so I have our LaCroix I did not go to Costco this time so I bought a couple of 12 packs Beach Plum from Costco is my absolute favorite so I was really excited to find this in a 12 pack and then we're gonna try this peach pear which sounds really good case of water and then for lunches this week we're trying to do uh, like a sugar fast um, so we're going to do um, turkey or ham roll-ups. So we'll just take a couple slices of this and one of these cheeses and just do a little roll-up and it'll be kind of a carb-free type lunch. My daughter will do this for her lunches this week and then also the honey ham my son will use with his bread to take sandwiches. My husband and I also will use the steamer, this Tuscan seasoned broccoli. This is so, so good. It doesn't have any added sugar in it. And we'll steam this and split this, and that'll go with our roll-ups. Super good. Snacks, we have these carrot sticks, and then I'll chop up this cucumber and just put a little bit of salt and pepper. Boiled eggs are a staple for us when we're doing sugar fast because it is a really good quick way to get some protein and also just help with that feeling of just like you're really really hungry milk I hate milk my son <laughs> will drink this just by itself or in his cereal which we have a lot of and then my daughter wants to try these out these little teriyaki seaweed things which is just totally not for me and then dinners so I already have ground beef in my freezer so with that we're gonna do a taco salad night so I just needed some romaine and salsa we already have shredded cheese um, what else oh uh, and sour cream and all the other stuff that we needed for that and then I'm gonna dice up some red onion with that one tonight I am making salmon with Greek salads so for that romaine I have diced or sorry, sliced black olives, feta, and then I will slice up one of these red onions. And then I make my own dressing with a extra virgin olive oil and a garlic seasoning. Um, and that is so good, super, super healthy. And then the third meal I'm making is a fajita, shrimp fajita bowls. So I got two bags of these jumbo shrimp and I bought two because I have some teenagers that will run through this pretty quickly. Also, my youngest son won't eat any of that, so he'll probably just make a bowl of just shrimp that night, so I always make sure I have extra. So I will saute this with bell peppers, onion, which I have a yellow one in the refrigerator, and um, saute this all together, and then this will go on this rice cauliflower. Um, so that is our meals for the week. The first thing I'm going to do is wash all of our fruit. I like to separate all of it into different colanders and then I rinse it with cold water and then I splash just a little bit of vinegar on all of the fruit and then let that rinse out really well. You cannot taste or smell the vinegar when this is done and I feel like this just keeps the vegetable, sorry, the fruit um, fresh longer and also with our grapes. Um, it keeps that like nice crunch to the grapes instead of them getting really mushy like they can sometimes and so we like to do this it makes the the fruit just last longer and everyone seems to grab it more often I'm going to put everything away and then in this video I'm actually going to share a really easy affordable crock pot meal um, it is not part of this grocery haul that you saw here. It was something I re had recorded the day before, but I really wanted to share it because uh, when you are a larger family, you just need um, affordable ideas sometimes. And I love this one because this one always seems to be a, a family favorite. I will leave the prices um, of each item when I show that recipe and show you how much the entire meal costs.
Now I'm gonna share this grape jelly meatballs. I know that sounds really strange, but I promise you this is really, really good. I'm using Italian meatballs, grape jelly, and this chili sauce. So I am doubling everything because we are a family of six with four of us being teenagers and they will come back for seconds, sometimes thirds. Um, so you do not have to double that. Just cut everything that I just showed you in half. You just pour it all in your crock pot, just like I'm showing you. And then I cooked this on high because I started later in the day for just like three, four hours. And then just come in throughout and just give it a good stir. And then you can put this on top of mashed potatoes. And this is a really easy and delicious meal on like a rainy day or a cold night, um, but so affordable. Now I'm going to refill the scent beads and our Tide Pods and finish up our laundry. And then next my kids are gonna take over from here. They're going to fold my laundry and then clean the kitchen on the next night. Um, and this is Ryan and my daughter Riley. Trying to get away from this life I'm living Same old things every day Wanna change this feeling Wasting no more time Don't care about what you're saying Try to keep me down No time for all your playing Yeah, even if you doubt me now You should know I don't care about The things you say
love the way I live That is a 24 karat dream No supermodel in my dirty jeans But in my 24 inches heels I am not pretending I'm born like this a game for the reckless It's so extreme and I don't really care Calling me a mad woman, mad woman No, I don't really care, I don't really care, yeah Cause boy, it's none of your business If I'm a mad woman so much for watching my video if you've made it this far uh, Ryan and Riley did a great job kind of I'll probably go back in and fix a couple of things um, but it's always fun playing around with them um, any way you can connect with your teenager is a win for me also don't forget to subscribe and hit like and also hit that bell notification if you want to be notified every time I post and I will see you all in my next video bye Take